What, what's more important, good sound or a good time? Sounding good, having a good time. I remember thinking maybe New York isn't the kind of city anymore that produces iconic bands. The Strokes launched a fireball. Started playing New York a year ago. We've been tearing stuff up. A lot of people quit their jobs and just were like, I'm going to play music full time. We felt like we were going to take over the world. People went crazy for it. Suddenly, there were bands everywhere. It all happened so fast. <laughs> Right team, go team. Go team. Hey. Julian was telling me how scared he was. Things were never going to be normal for him again. Being a woman fronting a rock band, I was sensationalized. There was a lot of tension in the studio. He said, you really don't want people to hear this. But I've lived in fear my whole life, and I had nothing to lose. He could feel the love from the community. He could fail, and he didn't matter. It was about freedom. It became her home. Those years were the big bang of my life. You guys want to be in a documentary? <laughs>